Hi guys, welcome to this session in Microsoft Excel. In this module, I want to show you how you can create a chart based on data from multiple sheets without consolidating the data. So what I've got is a blank sheet and I've got some salespeople, person one, two and three. These are all formatted as tables. What I'm going to do on this one, on each of them in fact, is just add the total. So if I tick that, it will just add the total at the bottom there for Steve. I'll just do that for each of them. Just go to table design, tick the total, open that up a bit, and then the same for Anne. Click into the table, and I'll get that. So those are the three cells that I want to come and get for my little column chart. So I'm back to sheet one. So you insert the chart in the same way, except I haven't selected any data, that's the difference. I'm selecting a column chart, 2D column, and it just gives me an empty box on the screen. If you go to select data, you've got this option to add. So the label I'll call Steve, the first person Steve. Now I need to select some data from here, so click on this little arrow, go down to the first person, click on the total, bring that back, click OK to that. That's the first one done. You can see the bar there, go in add. And now I'm going for the second person, clicking on that one. This is Dave. And then the last person add click on that little arrow go down pick that one bring it back and this is Anne okay okay and then you get the three people sitting there don't really need the label at the bottom like that so this information is looking at those. Now, if you add the data labels, so data label is just going to put the figures above each of those. Now, chart title, I'll just call it staff. So that's my little chart. I'll push that over there. So that's looking at those three people. And that's how you grab data from separate sheets using that. I could have done this. I could have just basically gone equals, gone down to the first person, clicked on that, tick that back, and then done the next one, equals, next person, click on that one, tick that, and bring it back. Like this equals third person click on that one Oops. and tick and bring it back and then you've got the three people there and then you could just highlight those I could put the labels there Steve Dave and Anne and you'd achieve exactly the same if I just move that over a bit highlight the three of them insert column chart like so and there you go the benefit of doing it that way is you get the labels at the bottom uh, whereas I didn't get the labels at the bottom there the series labels so it's up to you which way you want to do it whether you find it easier to do it like that we're starting off with a blank chart or you want to pull the information through like this with a formula and then base the chart on it like that. It's totally up to you. But that's all I want to talk about in this little video, how you can create a chart, pulling data from multiple sheets, two different ways. Thanks for your time and I'll catch you on the next one.